Hey, hey, my beautiful Struggle family. Welcome back to our channel. We've got a lot to go over today. We're gonna be, um, what are we gonna be doing today? Well, we're gonna be stuffing some envelopes. <laughs> if that's why you clicked on this video, <laughs> keep on watching. All right, everybody, so due to a rather large operator error, um, I accidentally have to film this video again. So second time's the charm, here's hoping. This is all the money I was able to save for March Madness. Uh, I said in my previous video that I will likely be no, not likely. I will be making an extra debt payment with this cash. So let's go ahead and see what my total was for March Madness. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Plus one, oops. <laughs> Excuse you guys can't see what I'm doing off screen. Just using my calculator. You know I struggle. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, plus 10 and 100. So my total for March Madness is $204. That's so great, you guys. I'm so happy. That was such a fun challenge to do. I hope you guys were able to, you know, follow along at home, do it at home, and that, you know, you guys were able to make some really good progress with that. So this is gonna go to the bank. Okay guys, so this week we're gonna be stuffing a total of $481. I'm gonna go out of order this week. I wanna just go ahead and give the money account from the bank, make sure we've got what they say we got. One, plus five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 20, 30, 40, plus 10, 20, 30, 40, plus 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 100, and 81. That's right, okay, we're good. <laughs> How's everybody doing out there this week? Is everybody doing okay? Moving forward. The struggle is real, but it is beautiful. Like life is beautiful. We embrace the struggle on this channel because it's a part of life and we laugh at it. We love it. So moving on to the wallet stuffing, we're going to be, I already said stuffing $481. $245 is going in my wallet envelopes. $131 is going in my cash envelopes and $80 is going into my sinking funds. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into this. Gas is gonna get a 60 bucks. So 20, 40, 60. Groceries, where are you? There you are. Is gonna get 120. 20, 40, 60, 80, 120. My kiddos is gonna get $5, R, sorry. We can speak English here. Um, <laughs> my kiddos are gonna get $5 in their envelope. Spending is at zero, and I know I just stuffed my kiddos into my spending. It's a long story, long story short, I don't have a kiddos envelope in this set. I need to make one. So the kiddos $5 is going in the spending. Miscellaneous is gonna get its usual 60. Okay, so there's our envelopes for the wallet, all stuffed up, ready to go. Let's go ahead and move on to our cash envelopes. Have a little surprise for you guys in here. Dun, da, da, da. Okay, so this is one of my envelopes that's available on my Etsy shop. This is my 30 day savings challenge envelope that we're gonna be starting today and we're gonna stuff it today. We'll come back to it at the end. All right, so Beauty is not gonna get anything but she's got $20 in there. I know because I've already filmed this video once. <laughs> okay, Boss Lady is gonna get a $5 bill. Clothes is gonna get a 20. Sorry if you hear my kids, you know, they live here and everything, so. <laughs> Clothes is gonna get a 20 happening with that too. Come on. There we go. Okay. Giving is going to get a dollar. Okay. 
Let's see how much we've got in there now. 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Wonderful. That's going to bring up someone's day. A few notches, I hope. Okay. Giving's at 14. Household is going to get a $5 bill. Household is 25, 35, 36. was just messy. Wow. Come on, Mia. <laughs> Laughing at myself. Okay. My envelope is not getting stuffed and it's at zero. That's okay. My mama's envelope is going to get a $5 bill. Let's see what she's got in there now. Add that five. Mom's got 20, 40, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80. Looks like she got in here for a little something, something. Okay, tuition is gonna get 90. So my daughter's pre-K tuition is due May 1st and every month it's $350. So this week we gotta stuff 90. 20, 40, 60, 80, $90. Okay. So that's sitting pretty at 90. My Uncle David's envelope is gonna get a $5 bill. My uncle is doing wonderful. Thank you to all you fabulous people out there sending prayers and blessings. He's recovering from a colon cancer. Anybody who's new here and it technically the doctor said it was unbeatable, but he's beaten it. I don't, we don't know. Yeah, he's actually probably going to go in a medical journal here soon. 2535. This is money I set aside for my uncle. So he, you know, he can, you know, go get a cheeseburger or something because cancer amongst all the other awful things is it's shamefully expensive that's awful i can't believe how expensive it is to have a terminal illness it's terrible anyway okay debt snowball all right so we have right now one two thousand in the bank and forty dollars what we're gonna do is combine the money from march madness and we're gonna stick it in here like that Look at that envelope. Oh, have mercy. I love it. And then I am taking that out. Mama's going to the bank. All right, let's flip back to our 30 day cash savings challenge. It's going to get a $5 bill. So go ahead and get that stuffed up. We're going to go ahead and pick a square. I don't care which square. We're going to do that one. Take my Sharpie out of $5. I love it. I finally have my own savings envelope. This is really exciting. And it's on my Etsy shop if you're interested. All right, moving on to our sinking funds. Back to school is going to get a $5 bill. Oh, have mercy. Come on. There we go. I love these vinyl zipper envelopes, but sometimes they give me trouble. Okay, so now back to school has $25, $35. Awesome. Beds for the kiddos is not getting stuffed right now. Let's go ahead and give her a count. 100, 210, 11, 12. So $212 in there. If you guys are at home and you know haven't been well let me let me start again if you guys there at home or wherever you are when you're watching this video are interested in starting the cash envelope system for you or whatever kind of method um using cash envelopes just go ahead and get started with one envelope just start with one see how you like it it can get kind of overwhelming but it can change your life if you stick with it it changed my life when i started doing it years ago and it still continues to actively improve my life which is why i continue doing it and it's it's great for real Okay, so birthdays is gonna get a $5 bill. Birthdays and now has 100, 20, 40, 60, 70, 71, 72, 73, which is great. My mama's birthday is coming up in May, so we'll be able to get her something really nice with this. 
car maintenance is gonna get its usual $20. So now car maintenance has 100, 200, 300, 350, 370, 390, 410, 15, 20, 25, 35. Woo, I just counted those odd numbers, you guys. It's all about the confidence. That's what I figured out. And watch, that'll just be the envelope I miscounted. Would you let a girl know down below if I messed that up? Thank you so much. Okay, emergency fund is getting its usual 20. All right. I don't know what happened here. Okay, so we've got $1,000 in the bank. That's our blinged out placeholder. And we've got 100, 200, 300. So 4,000. 4, oh my goodness. Let's start this again, shall we? Okay, we're starting that again. That wasn't pretty. Okay, here we go. So emergency fund has 1,000. 1, 2, 3, 50. 1,350 plus 20, 40, 60, 80. Minus two, because I just messed that up. $1,430. That is so exciting, you guys. As soon as I hit 1,500, that 500 is gonna go into the bank with the other 1,000, and I'll just be starting up again to another 500, and then 1,000. What did I say? Yep, your girl gets off on those speeches. Oh, I'm telling you. Okay. So now gifts is gonna get a $10 bill. Okay, now gifts has 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 111, which is good. This is the envelope I'm using for holidays and other than Christmas. So I'm gonna take gifts out. I have to go Easter shopping for my kiddos. Health is not getting stuffed and it's been at $200 for a while. I don't need to put more money than that in there. Kiddos savings is gonna get a $10 bill. So now kiddos savings has 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90. Yay, 390 in kiddos savings. Once that hits 500, I'm taking it to the bank and putting it in there with their other 500. Our home envelope is not getting stuffed, but she's gonna get counted. She's got 100, 20, 40, 60, 80. This is the down payment for our future home envelope. I'm keeping it alive, I'm just not, it's not a focus right now. I'm trying to really focus on my debt payoff. All right, taxes is not getting stuffed and taxes has 100, 200, 300, 420. Oh, that's right. My 420 envelope. <laughs> okay. Christmas is going to get a $10 bill. So now Christmas says 100, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 95. That's great. 195 in Christmas. So that's our sinking funds all stuffed up. And I believe this last 20 is gonna go into our savings account. Yes, it is. So mama's gonna take that to the bank. Okay, you guys, that's all I've got for you today. I hope that you enjoyed the cash stuffing. Be on the lookout for my Etsy budget with me and paycheck uh, allocationing video, allocationing. What is that? Is that even a thing? Anyway, please stay tuned for my next video. I hope you guys are finding yourself most loved happy, and remember, you're amazing. Have a great rest of your week, guys. Bye.